Welcome to Portico on Bridge, premium international immigration experts. My name is Traffic Buziti, co-founder and CEO. Today I'm here to talk to you about a subject which is very close to my heart, a subject I'm extremely passionate about, a subject that has encompassed the vast majority of my adult life, and that is the property market. Today, we will talk about the Maltese property market, the market of my home country. For 35 years, I have been developing, investing and helping people achieve their dreams on the island of Malta. On the 10th of September, the Times of Malta ran a very interesting article under the headline, more property sold in August 2021 than a year ago. It continues to quote a report issued by the National Statistics Office of Malta, wherein they were analyzing the number of contracts done in the month of August. It's, the report states that in the month of August 2021, there were 1,137 final deeds registered an increase of 197 deeds over August 2020, which will equate to a staggering 17% increase. The report continues to state that the value of the property transactions was a staggering 239 million euro, which will equate to an increase of 37.5% over August 2020. Now we need to put these numbers into perspective. Let us not forget that the island of Malta, we are just 500,000 people who live on the island. So when you look at these numbers and these property transaction numbers in comparison to our population, they are truly staggering amounts. The report continues to state that 1,048 of these property transactions were done by individual homeowners. And this is the biggest show of confidence in the Maltese property market. And just approximately 90 transactions were done by businesses. Individual buyers during the month of August 2021 invested approximately 203 million euro into the Maltese property market. The highest number of property transfers took place on both ends of the island. The southern part are doing better than the northern part, but in the southern part, the highest number of transactions were registered in Sampar, Shire, Seitu. Masaskala, Masas Schlock region, 155 final deeds. In the northern part, the most active was Meliha and St. Paul's Bay, with 148 transactions. This goes to show that the southern and the northern part of the island are the most active on the property market as we speak. The lowest number of deeds were registered in the Southern Harbour area, in towns or cities like Vittoriosa, Calcara, Senglia, Cospicua, with just 13 transactions. Also, an area which did not see a lot of activity was the area of Floriana, the capital city of Valletta, Marsa, Amrum, Pieta and, and Santa Venera, with just 48 final deeds of transfer. Here we could see that the central southern harbour area is losing a bit of its park. This was extremely popular a few years back, however, it seems to have stabilized. The report also goes or continues to quote the number of promise of sale agreements. Now, this number is extremely important because it shows the activity of the market in the next few months. 891 promise of sale agreements were registered in the month of August 2021. Now, let us not forget 
Like in the Mediterranean island like Malta, August is a holiday month. So when you are registering 891 promise of sale agreements, that means that the market was extremely active and vibrant. Out of these 891 promise of sale agreements, 787 of which were done by individual property owners. The largest number of property sale agreements was done on the sister island of Grozo with 136, followed by Xira Tajbish. Imsida with 112. The lowest number of promise of sale agreements was registered there again in the southern harbour area. Vittoriosa, Senglia, Cospico, and Calcara registering just 13 contracts. All the above numbers that I've mentioned today goes to confirm one very important point about the Maltese property market that this market has always been a strong, secure, stable market. If you like our channel, please like and subscribe. If you have a more in detail question, please send us an email on info at porticoandbridge.com. One of our 50 international property consultants will be more than happy to help you. At Portico and Bridge, your children 